I'm Dr. Phil. And this here lady pretty near saved your life. Hello there. <laughs> I'm Mrs. Peacock. My husband and I, we're the ones that found you. There you are, Woody. Thank you. Well, don't you go rushing off any place until you feel 100%. You hear? Yes, ma'am. I have to mother you while you still have a roof over your head. <laughs> oh, on no. Are you expecting tea? No. So, Hollywood. Hello. Not Tin Pan Alley? Well, yes, it is. Who's calling? He has a way of leaving pictures. <laughs> Minnesota? Well, how can... Dr. Field, yes. Uh, would you hold on for just a moment, please? Esther? It's a juvenile center in Minnesota. What? Something, corrections. You talk to him, Jack. They think it's Woody. What do they know about Woody? Uh, they say they're looking for some, yes, uh, a juvenile, but some state, you know, <laughs> fugitive. <laughs> Certainly not Woody. <laughs> So, neatness doesn't really count. Uh, not when you're about to pass out. <laughs> no. Bless you. Tough day? Lately, we're putting out more bullshit than air freshener. Uh, don't touch! They're dumping my orderless bleach idea, but I talked them into letting me keep my beta samples. Talked them into... <coughs> Just say they owed me. It's one thing to take my ideas and keep all the profits, but to dump something because a new VP doesn't want to be upstaged by a woman. You getting sick? <sighs> I hope it's a cold. Flu's supposed to be really nasty this year. <sighs> what would you say if I told you I was thinking of taking up chess? I'd want to know the girl's name and how much it's going to cost. <laughs> Mr. Rasu left your package. It's over by the door. Oh. There's a trip to Montreal. It's 5.50, but I think I can get a discount. Her name's Annie. Uh, good luck. Leonard? Are you okay? You see? It does not look right. It's too powdery. Drink it up. It'll do you good. Mm. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. E.B. did that on her last flight. I just haven't had the heart to clean it up. Far good. Far good. Hi, my name is Captain Gilbert. Hello. Nice to meet you. Would you have a moment to spend with me, to talk? Yes. Very good. This is it's been Very difficult for you these last few months, especially with your little girl. It could have been worse, I suppose. Hitler could have survived. You obviously come to terms with the truth. I only wish your husband could do the same, but he persists in remaining loyal to Hitler's memory. Yes. I cannot understand it either. Such loyalty. A man who wanted us dead. I'm sorry? Hitler ordered all of us to be shot. Hermann, myself, our precious child. That is why we surrendered to the Americans. Why else would we have done such a thing? I have some of the lovely food. There is talk that you will all be hanged. I won't be hanged. That I assure you. That I pledge. 
Perhaps the court will send you to an island, like Elba, and we could join you there. Go on, eat, eat. <laughs> Do you think that we would be allowed to take some of the food home with us? I don't see why not. Yeah. Okay, I'll be right there. Hey, mister. Hey, T, what do you want? Thought we could have a drink, like old times. There's a glitch with the product launch. I have to go. I'm sure that it can wait. No, it can't wait. I have to go. It's included in the price. Free, as it were. But I don't want a bath. No bath. No girl. Yeah. OK. Josette, could you give this gentleman a bath, please? <laughs> Aside from the fact that you broke just about every school board safety code in the book, and that my monitor exploded. I liked it very much. <laughs> what? Are you joking or what? I never joke. Miss Baker? Well, if you didn't know, Billy B. McCarty come down off the eternal hillside. Oh, my yellow dog run off. You see anything? Or... Oh, children. No loose critter do wise around here. I had a panther attack last night, bomb and kill our pony. Yeah, sorry to hear that. Number days for counting blessings. Can't say I ever counted much on those. You're a good man, Mr. McCarty. Happy Halloween to you. I think if we just took a second to just, talk. No, it's just that in future I'm just going to be too busy for chess. So. You know, I'm glad that you came. I'm glad that we were able to fit it in. Um, 